hello and welcome back to football lab yeah in this channel we do football talk we live football we do everything about football football analysis match day analysis and also we offer betting tips we also cover football transfer news and the rest of them please if you have not subscribed to this channel please kindly do so by hitting the subscription button down below Okay, before we go forward, I just want to let you know that whatsoever information you're receiving here is my personal opinion and is for information purpose only. It's in no way a financial advice. We don't give financial advice. You are responsible for this information. There is no guarantee of profit no loss. Also, we say no to underage betting. If you know that you are below 18 years, please kindly do me a favor do not watch this video please okay having said that let's go straight to what we have for today thank you let's start our review this morning from the following games we will analyze this and also offer some tips Germany versus Denmark let's look at the head-to-head -head. we have two games here and Germany winning one and Denmark winning the other one okay look at let's look at the team four Germany have played home games five of them and they won three draw two draw one and lose one Denmark are very good win four draw zero and lose zero yeah I might take some days okay I believe the both teams should score and also 1.5 and also I'm gonna kiss I expect the first half to be over 3.5 England Austria let's look at the right to head okay England win two lose zero draw to Austria lose two draw to win zero the team form Austria home record um away record is very okay England the home record is very okay as well England scoring in four of their five and home games Austria scoring all their away games okay here my take on this England to win and I expect over 2.5 goals and first half corner kick I expect it to be over 3.5 Okay, let's look at France versus Wales. Let's take the head to head. We have only one game here, and France dominated by playing 2 0 win. Let's look at the team for France home record F1 2, lose 1, draw 2. Wales away record F1 2, lose 2, and draw 1. In my opinion, here, I expect first half on a kick to be over 3.5 and France to win at least either half of the game. That is my opinion. The next is Netherlands Scotland. Okay, head to head. Netherlands have win four times. Scotland winning once. And one important thing here, one thing to notice here is they have never done both teams to score. There's only one team dominating at the end of the game. Okay, let's check the team form. Netherlands have from their previous home five matches, they want to lose two and draw one. Scotland away, they want to lose two and also draw one. Okay, here is my take on this. I expect Netherlands to win either half of the game. Okay, Zambia, Super League, Zeraco versus Ghana. Data showing here is data from their last 10 games. Average goal scored for the Nago is 1.2 goals per game. Average goal considered is 1.3. In Karma United, average goal is 1.5. That's the goal they've scored. Average of goals considered is 1.4. Okay, based on this data, I will go for 1.5 goal. That's my personal opinion. From the data showing on the screen, the both teams have played a total of 33 games. Bloom City, which is the home side, have won only 5. Amelo the Sundowns has won 19 times. The match that ended in draw is 9 games. So the percentage of the home team to win is saying 15%, while to the tendency for a draw is 20 percent and for the away win is 40 
and 58 percent okay with this data i will go for a straight away win either half of the game i'll say a way to win either half of the game okay that's all we have for today tomorrow we'll be doing a much more games today is just a very short video tomorrow we'll cover more games we'll give more analysis more tips if you have not subscribed to this channel please do so by subscribing and also like the video and share it with your friends thank you very much for stopping by god bless you